This Raw Vision video is brought to you by Metro Solar, proud partner of the Richmond Football Club. Um, boys, today I'm uh, announcing my retirement. Um, I've been uh, managing a degenerative knee for a long time now and unfortunately it's caught up with me this year. It's, um, it's been a huge honour to represent this club and something that I'm very proud of. Um, pulling on the Richmond jumper to run out and play is a feeling that I'll never forget and um, something that I'm very grateful for. Uh, I've, um, I've absolutely loved my time here and consider myself lucky to have been around the club for so long and uh, while injuries uh, have caught up with me, um, I'm comfortable uh, with the fact that I've always exhausted everything possible to get the most out of myself. It's been um, ridiculously hard at times, but uh, more so unbelievably rewarding. On reflection of my career, I tend to generally sort of think about the more recent times, and this year has been um, incredibly frustrating and disappointing the way it's panned out, and certainly didn't see it happening like this, um, but that probably also takes me back to the second half of last year and um, it, was, um, it was unbelievable to play in those nine straight wins which resulted in that, uh, that my first final and um, it's something more so now I'm um, more than ever grateful for. Um, I, uh, I, I spent the last few minutes of the, uh, the Sydney game on the bench and um, watching the efforts of um, Dusty and um, Rancy and <coughs> Brando, that tackle and Griff, um, and heap of other blokes who was <coughs> unbelievable to be a part of and um, the feeling uh, when that final siren went in Sydney was, was the best feeling I've ever had on, on a football field so thanks very much for that. Um, on the back of that it's it's an unbelievably exciting time around the club now and I've got no doubt that with um, hard work and a steely resolve, you boys can achieve something huge. Um, the time is now though and I love the quote that Evie uses around stoppages and that's um, shop early and beat the rush and I think that applies to careers as well, to the young blokes in the room. Um, be in a hurry to succeed, it, uh, it, it does go quick and um, that can end abruptly, so always make the most of your opportunities. Um, there's a lot of people I'd like to thank. I, uh, I won't go into many details, but um, firstly, the medical department, in particular Shaq and Reg. Um, I've had a few battles to overcome at times and I um, just want to thank you for all your support. To Dimmer, all the coaches, all the fitness staff, um, the entire football department. I thank you very much for your help. Um, I'd like to mention my family, uh, my parents, who have been an enormous support for me and have been from a young age and helped me achieve the childhood dream, um, which is something I certainly don't take for granted. Um, I'd like to thank my wife, Kate, um, your star, and uh, You've been an amazing support for me and I'm very lucky. Um, and finally, and most importantly, my teammates. Uh, I've got some incredible mates in the room and um, some that have also retired. And especially the older boys. We've been through a lot together and uh, thank you very much for your mateship. I uh, can't explain how many fond memories I've got um, from all my teammates over over 12 years and um, no doubt I'll sit back and have a good laugh at times about um, some of the things that have happened in the locker rooms and in a state and on um, you know training camps and Rancy will feature in a lot of those. <laughs> um, it's, um, it's been a lot of fun but without a doubt uh, the one thing that I'll definitely miss the most is 
is putting on the armour on game day with you boys and, and running out to play. Uh, that feeling is something very something very special and, and something that I'll never forget. So um, I've met some great men and made some lifelong mates. So thank you very much.